Hey guys, so I haven't filmed, uh, well, yesterday it was Monday and I didn't film anything and today I don't really feel like there's going to be anything to film either because pretty much my day-to-day -day schedule has been turned into job hunting because, um, money is getting tight and I need, a you know, a constant income instead of a sporadic one with my freelancing. Um, and when it comes to working in a salon, it, you basically, you have to pay to work there. Most of the time it's like a booth rent and then, um, and then you make income off of, uh, your clients and stuff like that. So I need like a real everyday paid by the hour job. Um, so today I just like put in a bunch of applications to a bunch of makeup counters even though I look shot out today It's okay. Hey guys, I am going to go pick up lunch for Cody and we're gonna have lunch together So I gotta go to Porta Subs really quick and then I'm gonna go to the mall and start passing out my resume <laughs> To a bunch of different places. I made it a point to wear this crappy jacket right now So that if I get food on my shirt that is just this stupid jacket and then I have my cardigan in the back I wanted to tell you guys that if you don't know about my store envy account I have all of my retro doll necklaces on that site and I also have some of my old clothes on there um, for sale and I have a deal going on where it's a holiday discount um, and it's 50% off everything in the store if you use the discount code 50 dolls I'll put the discount code and the link to the site down below check out that creeper jeez <laughs> No, thank you. Wait, actually, that might be a good deal. I might do that. <laughs> Look how cute is that? It's gonna be Santa. Santa! Look, it's Santa. So I was walking by and these guys wanted to say I something. Love, guys. <laughs> They're so good. Love your girl. Follow me. Twitter, Instagram. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, if you're in Fresno and the Fashion Fair Mall, just go check them out. All right, see you guys. Okay, so I got Cody some clothes because I got him a jacket from Target that he tried on in one of my last retroactives. Um, but they didn't have it in his size, so I went to size up, but I just didn't feel right about it. So I decided I'm going to return that, and I got him some new clothes. Ooh, look at this calendar I just found. I'm going to buy it. Yay! So I just went to Hot Topic and got uh, Cody some stocking stuffer things, but it was buy one get one 50% off. So I decided to get myself some cute glasses. What do you think? I dig them. Because I have a pair like this already, but it has a bow on the side of it. So I wanted to get some that don't have a bow. But anyways, um, now I'm going to go to Urban Decay and give them my resume and hope for the best. buy one get one free off like the winter clothing and stuff and sex accessories so I got these purple leggings because they only had bright pink and then this purple and then I got some gloves down there because I don't have any so this is my first time ever in anthropology and I'm trying to find stuff for Amanda and look at this cute freaking apron like could that be cuter this is a separate piece but let me pull that back cute little apron right and then they have the oven mitt down there too this place is like ridiculously adorable okay so I'm kind of really just exhausted because I've been walking around for like three three and a half hours at the mall buying stuff putting in my applications and turning in resumes and all that kind of stuff and I kept getting a lot of compliments on my necklace if you guys um, haven't watched my videos before and you don't know where I got this I got it at a local boutique called Julia Vogue's but you can also get it at pinkamoreboutique.com and I'll put a link to their website down below um, it was about $20 speaking of necklaces like I said before 
I'm having my holiday sale going on right now. So it's 50% off everything in my store Envy shop. And I'll put a link to that down below because that's only going to be for a limited time. So um, go check that out and get what you can because not only is there the retro doll necklaces, but there's also some of my old clothes. So you can score on some awesome discounted plus size clothing. Yay, Dutch Brothers! I'm going to get mom a blended peppermint mocha and I am going to get myself a blended caramelizer. Dude, Dutch Brothers is so good like they have yet to disappoint me this is perfection like so much better than Starbucks and look at the size of this it was 375 and I got my mom's drink for free which was the same size as mine but I got hers for free because they have stamp cards so yeah and it was really good I stole a sip of hers and it was really good um, plus I really hate Starbucks mocha Ugh. Especially since I worked there, like just the smell of their mocha, I just don't like. But anyways, Dutch Brothers is bomb! It's my absolute favorite. And hey mom and Cody, if you're watching, uh, Dutch Brothers gift card, thanks! <laughs> I'm going to Ulta right now with my friend Nicole because they're having their... Her car just scared me right now. Um, they're having their Urban Decay Naked 3 palette launch right now so we're gonna go pick up the palette i'm at alta now and i got their urban decay it's the like 24 7 glide on pencil because this whole pack of one two three four, six pencils is like 20 something they're usually 18 each and um anyway so now i'm looking for some new eyebrow wax not like rip off your hair wax but like colored wax you put on your eyebrows or an eyebrow pencil. I was hoping that Anastasia's eyebrow pomade came out, but apparently it's just online right now. But Nicole's over there and going nuts for the Naked 3 palette, and they're trying to get me to buy it. But I'm saving up for eye masks. So here is the first edition of the Naked palette, which is basically like a neutral base kind of color scheme. This one was more of a grayscale. This is the Naked 2. And then here's the Naked 3, which is more of a pink and rose toned kind of eyeshadow collection. This camera isn't really doing it justice because it's a lot more beautiful and this is really showing. Like, this color, Blackheart, is unbelievably gorgeous. Oh, yeah, and then there's a the Naked Basic palette. But anyways, I think it's like $52 for that, so I'm like, I'll wait. Look at this fancy little Christmas card I got from Amanda. By the way, when we, oh wow, and it's a like fancy envelope, girl, you are just, you're too cool for school. Oh my God. When they get married, their invitations are gonna be redonkulous, and that's the first time I've ever used that term, so you know I mean it. But seriously, look at the pattern on this. It is so freaking adorable. And then they have their like perfect little cute couple picture and joy to the world and stuff. And and especially you, Amanda in DC 2013. This is ridiculously adorable. Like I feel like I have to post it up in my house somewhere. But right now it's just going to be in my little visor area. So that, thank you, Amanda. Also, I need to text her. Because I have her present and I need to get it to her somehow. Anyways, so that's cute. <laughs> I just got done at Target and mom's gonna meet us at the nail salon, which is right there. Look at nails. So this is the before. And they're done. Mom, you wanna show your pretty fingers? Hers are sparkly. Sparkle, sparkle. <laughs> Where are we going? Uh, to the bank. And then, are we going to get your Christmas tree today? Mm -hmm. Sweet. Yay, Christmas tree shopping. So I feel kind of bad because I actually didn't film when Cody and I and my mom when Christmas tree shopping was actually really short because she found the tree like instantly and we're like, yep, let's do this. And it was 20 bucks. So, I mean, yeah, that was pretty easy. But, so now I guess that kind of makes up for it. You guys get to see a shop for her Christmas tree. Christmas tree, Christmas tree. Over here. Wow, woman, what is wrong mind. with you? Seriously. I decided to park this way. You know this is on camera, right? Yeah. 
So I have to be legal again. I have to park right. Don't just hang out behind people. Yep. Oh, bad. I don't want that. You don't want cash on my. Oh my god. That's like seven foot. Seven foot? That's more like 13. 13. I'm short. I don't know how measurements work. Ooh. Double me, though. And you're like five, what? Five nine? Eight. Nine. Eight. Five nine. Ooh, it smells so nice. Yeah. It's also pretty and crispy. Good. Like that one. This one's tall and fluffy. Woo! This one is modest. It is modest. I don't want it to be all wide because of the space I'm putting it in. I don't want to take it all up too. I know, but that looks like a good size. Stand next to it, mama. Ah. See, you're good. Yep. You don't need a ladder to put the angel or star on. All right. I don't want it. Cool. So it looks yeah. like it's this one. Yep. Can you see him? Yeah. You He's me? not very uh, sneaky. Yes, he is. Watch. Oh, he tries. He's gonna move. He's gonna move. Oop! He's in a hole. Oh, he's gone! He's gone! I saw a hole. Are you a gopher? Are you a gopher squirrel? I'm hiding. Quit finding me. <laughs> <laughs> Do it a bad hide and go seek. Put your seatbelt on. Uh -huh. So look what I just pulled up to. My mom trying to park with those stupid turduckins just sitting there doing nothing. And there's more over there. But look at them. And what did you have to poop or lay an egg? Like get to step in crazies they just don't care look I'll honk and they won't care nope they're shaking their butts let me shake your tail feather let me see you shake your tail feathers and mom's over there <laughs> it's on bitches I'm coming through. Get out the way. <laughs> they don't move. <laughs> That's right. That's right. guys so um, in like 15 minutes or so I am headed to a job interview like I have been telling you guys all week I have been job searching and you know busting my butt trying to find steady income instead of the sporadic income that I have with YouTube and with um, freelancing I honestly don't think that could have gone any better I am so happy the people there are so relaxed and it's a family. It's the owner, it, she has her daughter and her granddaughter working there as an esthetician and a manicurist. 
and they're so awesome and chill and they'll work with me for commission and they're okay with my IMAT schedule. Oh my God, I am like <laughs> beyond happy. Thank you, God. Thank you, everyone who crossed their fingers. Um, yay, I was just, oh, I feel so much relief. <sighs> I love you guys. This is chaos. We're going to Walmart to get mom's presents. Oh my God, I don't know if I'm prepared for all that. Ooh, she's got nice hair. Hydration belt? Look at that. There's fighting going on the other side of the aisle. Hydration belt? That's interesting. Hmm. We got mom's gifts now. We're kind of just walking around and he needs stuff for his car, so no surprise there. <laughs> I think even if he didn't need things for his car, he'd still get things for his car. That's the guy that was fighting. <laughs> to give that side of me up. <laughs> but I can if you know it's keep hurting my hand. Ooh. I'm on his side. Mm -hmm. Totes is happening here. It's usually so slow. Crazy. We're kind of we're like 45 minutes early to the movie. So we decided we we're gonna play in our little arcade games. I knew he'd go for Terminator. I didn't think about down. 